Many people with cancer wonder if there's anything they can do to boost their immune systems to fight off the cancer. Help their bodies deal with the side effects of treatment, and lower the risk of recurrence. We don't have evidence there's anything you can do to boost your immune system. However, there is a growing body of evidence that suggests you can take steps to help your immune system do its job. Common sense practices such as getting enough sleep, eating healthy foods, exercising, and reducing stress all appear to play some role in immune system function. Sleep. Getting seven or more uninterrupted hours of sleep per night can help your immune system function well. There's a growing body of evidence that sleep deprivation suppresses the immune system, lowering your defenses against illness and infection. Before, during, and after breast cancer treatment, good quality sleep is important. Breast cancer itself can be stressful, which can interfere with a good night's sleep. Certain treatments can cause side effects that interfere with sleep, too. For some women, breast cancer diagnosis happens as they're going through menopause, which also can lead to sleep problems. Occasional sleep troubles are okay, but if you're struggling night after night, it's time to take action. For strategies you can use to improve sleep, visit our insomnia page and the Think Pink, Live Green column Sleep Well, Turn In, Tune Out, and Unplug. If these don't work for you, talk to your doctor about possible options. Nutrition. A healthy, well-balanced diet is essential to your overall health and your immune system. Nutrition section gives you all the information you need to plan your diet and eat well throughout your treatment even at times when you might not feel much like eating. Also be wary of vitamins and supplements making claims that they can boost or supercharge the immune system. They're not likely to help any more than whole, fresh foods do, and some could even interfere with the treatments you're having. This too is covered in more detail in our nutrition section. Exercise. Researchers have long observed the positive effects of moderate amounts of exercise on the immune system. Our exercise section features detailed information about how to get started and maintain an exercise routine. How to exercise safely, and tips for exercise during and after various forms of breast cancer treatment. Stress reduction. It's well known that chronically high levels of stress hormones suppress the immune system and reduce the body's ability to defend or repair itself. That's why many cancer centers and hospitals have begun offering stress reduction therapy along with traditional cancer treatments such as chemotherapy and radiation. Meditation, yoga, massage, support groups, and other techniques may help you reduce stress. Which in turn may help keep your immune system functioning well. You can talk to your doctor or nurse to find out what's available and what may be the best fit for you. These are called complementary treatments because they are used together. With standard medical treatments such as surgery, radiation therapy, chemotherapy, and hormonal therapy. If you have found this video helpful, please like this video. It really means a lot to us. And if you think it might help one of your friends, don't be shy and share this video with them as well. That way, we all can help people we care about to live happier life. Make sure you smash that subscribe button and hit the bell icon to receive more informational videos that will improve your health and lifestyle. Thank you for watching this Boost My Immune System After Chemo Power video and we will see you on our next video.